just remembered there's a doobie in my pocket, in my shirt, in my suitcases. I'm standing in line to check into my flight and trying to decide if I should get out of line. But the line is really long and I start thinking about this song and about that hippie at the festival that gave me the doobie. That is in my pocket, that's in my shirt, that's in my suitcase that I'm planning on checking to my final destination, which is another festival with hippies and more doobies, so I don't really need the one that is in the pocket of my shirt and my suitcase, and I wonder if they'll find it, and I wonder what they'll do, depending on their mood, they can put it in their pocket of their TSA shirt, or maybe they're disgruntled and to spark it where they stand, or maybe they will give it to their friend Steve the cop, who will put it in his pocket and then give it to the roster that works at the Starbucks by gate 39, in hoping of continuing, of receiving his free triple tall Americano shots on top, that he desperately needs the extra caffeine, so that he can walk his miles and miles of luggage with his feet Female German Shepherd that he named Eva Blonde from that David Lindley song, or at least that song that Lindley does. I'm not really sure if David Lindley wrote it. He didn't. One thing is true: Steve the cop he likes it, or maybe he will simply throw the doobie in the trash to avoid all of the paperwork he can read in the ass. And this is what is going through my brain as I exit the plane and walk to baggage claim and pray for a keychain with a suitcase never came and I'll start to go insane there's a pace around with visions of one time in my bay no need to drool and everything is cool they found my suitcase on the way to Istanbul and they got it just in time put it on the next flight everything's okay I should receive the next day but once again it never came and once again I go insane cause it's time Never in my suitcase I was wearing it 